So in this video I'll be showing you how to create a sun bleached look for your photos. I'll be using this picture for the example and I'll leave links for all the pictures I use in the description. I first want to desaturate the colours so I'm going to the adjustment studio and I'm adding a HSL adjustment. Then I'm clicking on ranges and I'm bringing the saturation down to around minus 40%. And I'm bringing the luminance up to around 15% and the luminance just controls the overall brightness. And then to add more of a fade I'm going back to the adjustment studio and I'm adding a curves adjustment. Then I'm bringing down the highlights and I'm bringing up the shadows. Next I want to add a vignette, so I'm going to the filter studio, I'm going to colours and I'm turning on add live filter which just means the filter will be applied as a separate layer and then I'm clicking on vignette and then I'm dragging that filter onto the picture of the girl. So I'm bringing the exposure all the way down. I'm bringing the hardness down to around 50% just to feather the edges a little bit. And for the scale which controls the size of the vignette I'm putting that on around 100% and the shape on 85% which will make the shape more circular. And then to give it that sun bleached look I'm going to add some textures. So I'm adding this texture first and there's a few different blend modes that I think work quite well. There's Multiply, which can darken the picture a bit. Overlay, which keeps a lot of the colour in the photo. And Soft Light, which brightens the picture up but doesn't focus too much on the colour. So I'm putting this texture on Soft Light and I'm bringing the opacity down to 90%. But if you think it's too much, you can bring the opacity down a bit more. Then I'm bringing in this next texture and I'm resizing it using the Move tool so it covers the whole image and I'm putting the blend mode on multiply and I'm bringing the opacity down to 25%. Then to finish the picture I'm adding some noise. So I'm going to the filter studio, I'm going to all filters and I've got add live filters turned on and I'm clicking add noise. Then I'm bringing the intensity up to 6% and this will just help to give the picture a bit more grain and texture. And before I end the video I just want to mention someone who drew one of my pictures on a sketch app. I think his work is really good and I just wanted to show it here. I'll leave the link in the description so you can have a look at it. And if anyone wants to do something like this feel free to use any of my pictures and tag me in it because I'd love to see all your finished work.